All right, let's now move on. And some Kenyans would rather die than be caught anywhere near a farm getting their hands dirty or plowing or planting. But there are those who have made farming a way of life that guarantees them a rich, fulfilling life. Today, some of these people from around the world gathered in Nakuru for, believe it or not, a wild plowing contest. Victor Gale with more details from Joro. For the second time, the wild plowing contest was held in Kenya. The first time having been in 1995. Years down the line, plowing implements have changed as well as technology applied. The event attracted over 40 plowmen from across the world, with Kenya only fielding two participants. Compared to what our Kenyan brothers had to offer, the other participants seemed to have a field day as most of their implements were being operated by hydraulic systems. <laughs> For the Kenyans, the 64th edition of the World Plowing Contest proved to be a battle of wits after the equipment broke down hours to the competition. I was moving around so as to compare the way we plow and the way they do. And I've learned quite a bit, especially on the depth, the way they do their depth, the way they do their finishing, the way they cover the weeds and the like. Sababu ya leo kwanza ni sita ile nilianza tangu jana juusi. Sababu niliesa kupotesa ile control balo piangu msima. Na hiyo ndiyo inabarete kila kitu. Na unachua likuwa nimetrain sasa kwa ile kama hiyo wasungu. Nikuwa nimetrain na isi hydraulic system. So niliesa kufunja. Asa kufunja, imeesa kuharibu soso max yote ambaye alikuwa nimeesa kupata. Unajua kuna challenges pia ya conventional. Bila kufanya mazoezi kwa muda mzuri, hautafanya vizuri. The only challenge which we are seeing is uh, all these other people, I'm sure, they are engaged elsewhere. And I want to urge the government of Kenya to support Mr. Keegan in form of even giving him, even if it is casual employment. <laughs> Chief guest Uhuru Kenyatta announced that the country will borrow relief from the contest in terms of equipping the agricultural sector with modernized implements. And this is an area that we want to pay a lot of attention, especially with regard to mechanization. Some of the plows I saw there I've saw, seen for the first time. So we need to also see we to just idea when they to peer to use the equipment kama hi kwa wakulima wetu. The contest will end on 3rd of December. Previously, Kenya has participated in over 25 annual plowing contests, and the last four were held in Canada, France, Denmark, and England in 2016. Victor Ogale, KTN News, Nakuru County.